Fresh off a bye week, number 22, Ole Miss hosted the 15 ranked LSU Tigers, looking to bring the Magnolia Bowl trophy back to Oxford. Senior day at Bach Hemingway Stadium, Robert Kim DC standing in for his older brother Denzel, who's still in the hospital for what head coach Hugh Freeze is calling a personal matter. Late second quarter, the defense wreaking havoc. Brandon Harris tries to squeeze one in, but it's deflected and picked off by Christian Russell. The senior linebacker is going to get a big return, setting up good field position for the Rebels offense. And yes, they would capitalize. Kelly in the gun looks to his left because, of course, that's where Laquan Treadwell resides. The back shoulder throw is good for an 11-yard touchdown. Rebels up. To the second half, LSU would score 10 points right out of the gates. First a field goal, and then after that, recover a fumble. Leonard Fournette takes the handoff and reaches for the goal line. He fumbles, but his offensive lineman is there to recover it. Touchdown, LSU, lead cut to seven. But the Rebels respond big time following another Kelly TD. A little trickeration. Chad rolls to the right and throws the tight end screen back to the left. Nothing but space for Evan Ingram. 36 yard touchdown. And with that TD pass, Chad Kelly became the school's single season touchdown leader. And from there, the D would just pitch a shutout, forcing another pick. Ole Miss goes on to win 38 17. Man, thrilled. Anytime you win a rival game, uh, and you know, get to get to hold that trophy for a year. It means a lot to the Rebel fans, I know. We had a lot of energy tonight as well. Uh, senior night, a lot of emotions flying around. One of the send those guys, send those guys out at home with the right note, and uh, we, we were really playing for each other tonight. It was big for us, not just for me, but uh, for the singers also. You know, it was our last game in the fall. What, what, what better way to go out than beat LSU and get the Magnolia Bowl back?